next video is going to be the gender neutral baby haul of like all of the stuff that we have for the baby so far that is like gender neutral. So it looks like a lot of stuff on here, but it's really not a whole lot. This is pretty much everything that we have. We have like a couple other things, but this is the majority of the stuff that we have for the baby so far. So I'm gonna kinda just go down the line. This was not bought all in one shopping trip. Some of them were gifts, and I will go through and like explain who got what, when, where, and all that stuff. But I guess I'll go ahead and start over here. The main thing that you're gonna notice is that we don't have like hardly any outfits so far. So this is like literally pretty much all the outfits that we have. Um, this I got from Target and it is the Carter's brand and this was one of those things where I was just like it's so adorable boy or girl doesn't even matter it's just super cute so we did get this and then this was a three pack and this has the long sleeves which is kind of what I've been looking for because the baby is gonna be born in November but this comes with three different onesies and again newborn pretty much all the stuff that I've been buying has been like newborn or zero to three because I figured Anything after that, like that's bigger than the baby, like when it's born, is gonna be bought according to what gender it comes out to be. This, like I said in one of my videos, a lot of the stuff that we have are whales, and that's just like pure coincidence. That was not really intentional. There's just a lot of gray things that have whales on them, I guess, which is cute, I guess. Just, I don't know, it just was kind of weird to me at first. So, this is one of the onesies, it's just green and white with a little whale on it, and then this is just a plain onesie that is yellow and white, and then this one I love so much that I got the sleeper with it too, but this is a onesie as well that has like the mint colored whales, and then like the yellow whales, the gray whales, the white, and that's pretty much all with that. So, like I said, I got this as well. These are, these are size three to six months, and I think the only reason I got that size was because it was the last one that they had, but it's the same brand as this one. They're both the Circo brand. Both got it, or got them both from Target, and this is like the footy sleeper sleeper ones. And then on the other side as well, it just comes with a cute little outfit that says "I'm new here" with like the mint color and the gray. And then it comes with this little beanie also, and these little like striped pants. So then this outfit up here, these did not actually come together. This was what I bought for the pregnancy announcement. It's actually a preemie size, which I highly doubt this baby would be able to wear because my babies usually are pretty big, but you never know. Um, it's just a gray onesie and I bought it as a preemie size so that it would fit into the Easter egg from our announcement. These are just these little leggings with like the teal color again and the gray and the white and it's just like a nice neutral color. I got this beanie before the pregnancy announcement as well, I believe. So these are just things that were like quick purchases in the very beginning of the pregnancy. I mentioned in several of my pregnancy vlogs and I, I don't know if I said it yet in this video, but um, you're gonna notice that like the majority of this stuff is gray and yellow, and that's because like if you can tell, our room is gray and yellow, our bed stuff is yellow and gray, and then that's the kind of, that's the thing that we're gonna stick for for this baby as well because the baby is gonna be in our room for a long time. So we got like a white crib and we got the gray bedding, which is right there. I'll get to that, but so yeah, you're just gonna notice that a lot of this stuff is gray and yellow, and that's why because that's kind of the theme that we're sticking to. So this is just a plain yellow and white um, crib sheet. It's not really anything special. Got it from Target. And then these blankets I talked about in one of my pregnancy vlogs recently. This, it, These were both from Ross, especially since the baby's gonna be born in winter time. These will definitely come in handy. So there's this little whale one with the yellow on the other side and then there's this little like patterned gray and yellow one as well. These are some receiving blankets that we got so far. This pack I mainly bought for this one right here. I just really liked that receiving blanket, but these ones are cute as well. And same with this one, I just like the gray and I like the yellow, um, but obviously receiving blankets you use for like anything and everything, so you definitely can't have too many of those. And then this whole set I just really like. It has the elephants and the polka dots and the stripes and it's just all gray and white. So over here, this is something that Chris's mom actually got for us. She has gotten us probably the most things so far of like all of our family members. So she got us these little like jeans and these little socks and she got us these little booties as well and they're just like these cute little white booties. These are all stuff that Chris's mom bought for us as well. Just like green is like the, like the typical, like you can't go wrong with it, boy or girl. Same with yellow, I think. This whole set was definitely very gender neutral. So she got us like 
everything in this set. There's like these little sleepers and these little like burp cloths and these little towels, hooded towels, bibs, and some onesies as well. And then she just got us this little pack of like the multi-purpose. They're just like cloths. You can use them for cloth diapering, which I don't think anybody really uses these for anymore, but you can use them for like burping, changing. They're kind of like the receiving blankets also. This is another fitted crib sheet that I got from Target yesterday or two days ago. And this one is nice because it's like plush, so it's super soft. And it's just gray, so it matches the bed, the bedding as well. These two are blankets, and these are actually hand-me-downs. So a friend of mine gave me these, and I figured this one's very gender neutral. This one I would use for gender neutral. I don't know if every, everybody else was. It does have pink in it, but it's just such a cute pattern. I couldn't say no. It's so adorable. These are the Tula brand, and the way that they feel is just so soft and like comfy. So she gave me these and said that if I would use them, that I'm more than welcome to have them. And so, yeah, I just think they're super adorable. This set as well is from Chris's mom. And again, it's just like the little sleepers and these little flannel blankets, kind of like the receiving blankets and these onesies and these little beanies as well. And it's just tan and white. Again, just another like neutral color. I think she's just like super excited about buying all the stuff. She's just buying like literally everything that she can see that's gender neutral. So definitely useful. And then over here as well, this is from Chris's mom as well. And it's just like a little teddy bear, super cute little teddy monkey. And then these are the big items that we have so far. This is the boppy pillow that we bought. It has the chevron gray and yellow, or gray and yellow, gray and white on the side. And then on the front, again, it has those whales. We just really liked the colors of it and like the chevron print and stuff, but the whales are cute also. And it's definitely gender neutral. So that's one of the big purchases that we've made so far, as well as the crib nursery set. So this one is from Target. It is a four piece nursery set and it comes with the comforter, the crib sheet, a crib skirt, and a fleece blanket. And then I do have the sheets as well. And then I wanna put like added yellow touches to it because this one is just mostly gray. So once it's set up and everything, of course I'll show you guys. This again is from Chris's mom and I thought this was really cool. This is just kind of like a, a mix between like a bouncer and a bassinet and it's really cool because you can like fold these sides up. I've never seen it before, never even heard of it, but she got it for us and we'll definitely use it, I'm sure. And then this is the thing that I was talking about in my most recent pregnancy vlog. This is the Rock and Play and I had one of these with Landon and it literally like saved my life and I just fell in love with this pattern because you can tell it's yellow and it's gray and it just matches everything perfectly so we went ahead and bought that this is from Target it's the Fisher Price brand so yeah and that is actually pretty much everything that we have for the baby so far like I said we did purchase the crib it's not set up yet but once we get everything set up I'll do like a room tour slash nursery tour for you guys once we get everything up and ready. I know that everybody's been wanting to see what we have for the baby and I know it's not a whole lot, but like I said, once I have this thing, I just wanna like go shopping right away and just buy everything for it, him or her. We are still gonna buy some little necessity things like maybe some binkies and other little things like that. And of course for the home birth, that's gonna be a whole nother shopping trip in itself. This is what we have so far, but that is it for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope it was helpful. I will talk to you guys tomorrow for our next beta video. This pregnancy has been so tough on my body. I'm like ready for it to be over, but at the same time, my last trimester ever, like my last pregnancy trimester ever, like I don't know. It's just like, it's definitely bittersweet.